state legislators made controversial comments during a House committee meeting. It happened during the introduction of bills aimed at repealing state law that allows undocumented immigrants the right to have driver's licenses. Action 7 News reporter Aaron Hill has details from the Roundhouse. It's been a controversial law for more than a decade, allowing undocumented immigrants in New Mexico the ability to get a driver's license. Governor Susana Martinez hasn't been shy about her want to get rid of it. Repeal this dangerous law. Now, with Republicans controlling the State House of Representatives, new bills are making their way through the legislature. But last week, during a House Safety and Civil Affairs Committee meeting, the contentious law created some questionable comments. Democratic Representative Patricia Roybal Caballero said repeal would create division in the state and make some immigrant families second class citizens. Then she said this. This reminds me of, of uh, the stories we heard about the Holocaust. My goodness. That's her comparing repeal to the Holocaust, specifically when Jewish Germans were forced to carry special identification. And she wasn't the only one to make a controversial comment. Representative Cheryl Williams Stapleton said the efforts are an attack on civil rights. It's taking us back with a black little kid who can go in the same bathroom as the white child. On Friday, Roy Ball Caballero issued an apology for her comments. She said, in part, I regret my reference to the Holocaust made during a committee debate. I apologize to anyone who was hurt by my comments. Aaron Hilf, KOAT Action 7 News. We also reached out to Representative William Stapleton for a comment. She declined to give one. Now the bills to repeal the driver's license law passed the committee. They'll have to get through both the House and Senate before being signed into law. And on